It's a shame you have to go out in this weather. Don't you have a help? Hey? I thought you had a woman to help. I don't have any woman. I thought you had one when we first came. No women here. Maybe I was thinking of somewhere else. Plenty of women around the corner, of course. Oh, 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 oh. oh yes. Not here, though. Hey! Have I seen that before? Just an old rocking chair. Was it here when you came? No, I brought it myself. I could swear blind. I've seen that before. Perhaps you have. Eh? I say perhaps you have. Yes, perhaps I have. You going out there, Mr. Hudson? Just looking at your van. She's a very nice little van. I notice you keep her wrapped up for the cold. I was hearing you go off. Uh, um, when was it? Yeah, the other morning. Yes. Very smooth. I can tell it would gear change. I thought your bedroom was at the back, Mr. Kidd. My bedroom. Wasn't it at the back? Not that I ever knew. I wasn't in my bedroom. This was my bedroom. This? When? When I lived here. I must say, Mr. Kidd, this is a very nice room. Very comfortable room. Best room in the house. You must get a bit damp downstairs. Not as bad as upstairs. What about downstairs? Hey? Eh? What about downstairs? What about it? Must get a bit damp. A bit. Not as bad as upstairs, though. Why is that? The rain comes in. Anyone live up there? Not now. I used to keep a tack of everything in this house. I had a lot to keep my eye on then. I was able for it, though. That was before my sister died. I lost track a bit after she died. It was a good house then. She was a capable woman. Fine size of woman, too. I think she took after my mum. Yes, I think she took after my old mum, if I recollect. I think my mum was a Jewess. Yes. I wouldn't be surprised to learn that she was a Jewess. She never had many babies. What about your sister then, Mr. Kidd? What about her? Did she have any babies? Yes, I think she had a resemblance my old mum. Taller, of course. When did she die then, your sister? She uh, used to keep things in very good trim. And I used to give her a helping hand. She was very grateful. Right until her last. Always used to tell me how grateful she was for all the little things 
I used to do for her. Then she copped it. I was her senior. Yes, I was her senior. She had lovely boudoir. A beautiful boudoir. You fool at the moment, Mr. Kidd? Half town. All sorts, I suppose. <laughs> Where is your bedroom now, then, Mr. Kidd? Me? I could take my pick. You going out soon, then, Mr. Hudd? Be careful how you go. Those roads will be no joke. Still, you know how to manipulate your man. Don't you? Where are you going? Far? Be long. He won't. Be long. Oh, no, of course not. Shouldn't take him long. No. Well, I'll pop off. Have a good run, Mr. Hudman. There you go. It'll be dark soon, too. Well, not for a good while yet. A river dirty. Sorry. We didn't mean to be standing here, Mike. Didn't mean to give you a fright. We've just come up the stairs. That's all right. This is Mr. Sands. I'm Mrs. Sands. How do you do? Right. We were just going up the stairs. You can't see a thing in this place, can you, Toddy? Not a thing. What were you looking for? The man who runs the house. The landlord. We're trying to get out of the landlord. What's his name, Toddy? His name's Mr. Kidd. 